Hi guys, welcome back to another video. Today I would like to have a quick look at the new Doc 2 sets uh, for BM that were just announced. Um, this is really exciting. I just, you know, went onto um, YouTube after getting back from somewhere and just saw the um, that character options had posted something and it was the video for this. And I was just really, really excited because um, it's been quite a long time since we got BM sets. I mean, we did just get that, um, that second Doctor set, which was a character online exclusive, but I have to admit, um, I haven't done a review on that yet because... Uh, I just, I was extremely, extremely disappointed with that. Um, I seen some people who that which looks really good, but my figure was really good, but the paint job on my TARDIS was just, phew, it was so bad, so bad, and I wanted to think of return it, but they they had run out of stock, and I, you know, if I returned it, then I would, all I would get is my money back. I wouldn't be able to get a replacement, so you know, I kept it just because you know otherwise I wouldn't have it, and I wanted it because lot, lots of it is cool. It's just. And also the um, door on the left doesn't work, it doesn't like stay in place, which is annoying. But um, still, I kept it, and I still somewhat like it, I just, that paint job really annoys me a lot, especially on, there's just one door, just really annoys me. Anyway, so here is the, um, uh, here's the new um, sets for B&M, um, this is really exciting. So here's the first one from the Sensorites, um, and you can see there's, I guess these are called Sensorites, I haven't seen the episode, and they look actually really cool. I don't know if these are, uh, these might be completely new sculpts. Please tell me if these are completely new sculpts. Sculpts, um, I might be wrong about that, but I know some. Of the heads are definitely new sculpts, and the feet are definitely new sculpts. They have sort of weird feet. Um, so are these accessories, I'm pretty sure. And I'm not sure about the arms and torso. The arms might be reused. I think the hands are new. Anyway, I'm not 100% sure. But anyway, all I know is they look really cool. Um, I don't know the actual, you know, characters. Um, so all I'm seeing is these two new villains for me, but um. I think they're a really cool design, um, something quite unique and cool and a bit weird, which I like. But, um, then the first Doctor, um, he, um, the guy who makes these figures, he actually admitted in the video that the legs are the wrong colour, they should be grey, but they've gone for the red, uh, red like the um, 11, was it, the, was it the 13th Doctor figure set from quite a few years back? I do have that figure actually, um, and they are, the, yeah, the trousers are, yeah, um, trousers are technically sort of the same. Um, the body's really nice, the f the uh, painting on the face, you know, it ain't their top quality, but it's pretty good, especially for being an M set. So this one looks really nice, and I'll definitely get this one. The next one, we got um, the Keys on Marinus. Um, again, I, f I forgot the name of that guy, he, I, I do know I do know his character, but um, but I do have the name has suddenly escaped me. But anyway, the figure looks cool, but I believe this is these are just completely reused parts, except from the head. I think these this might be from Torch. I don't know the arms. The arms don't look like they fit on the body as well, so they might be from that might from be from a different figure. But anyway, um, yeah, the figure looks pretty good. Um, the face sculpt's nice. I don't know how accurate it is, um, because I have, haven't seen the character in a while. But um, the villains look really cool. I think these are the same sculpt as the last figure, except from the hands. Or well, at least one of the hands, which is new, and the feet, which are new sculpts, and the same with that sort of um sort of sash thing around them, that's new I'm pretty sure. But the head look the head sculpts, they look so nice. They're really, really good. And I definitely like it. So um not one that when I see them all in stores, um these won't be the first ones I pick up. I might get these a bit later on because these three three packs always stay in stock for quite a while. Um I'll definitely get this one first. And then let's move on to the Daleks. Um here's history of Daleks set five. Don't have three and four yet because um, they did not release in my part of the country for whatever reason. Still annoys me. Um, I forgot. I luckily I was able to get that fifth Doctor Tardis from Amazon. Um, same with, same with um, some of the other um, ones from that wave. Just not the Daleks and not the um, fourth Doctor fourth Doctor companion set, um, which I'm you know I'm a bit annoyed about. But I'm, I can get that one online. But these the Dalek set have, Dalek sets have gone up to like forty quid on eBay. So. I don't. I, don't I, I want them. I mean, I def. I definitely know that I want the one with the flame for us. So I might just get that one and not the other one. But I did want to collect all of them. It's just, it's so much money, really. I mean, I just, it is annoying. But anyway, here um, are the history of Daleks at five. Um, I don't know what story. What story is this from the from the Power of the Daleks, nineteen sixty six. Um, yeah. Anyway, these look pretty cool. The only problem is they come with the sort of the scoop, but they don't come with the alien or whatever it was that goes in the scoop. I don't remember what it was. Um, I know they released it in small in the smallest scale, but I mean, 
Yeah, it's pretty cool. It's new, it's new mold, that thing. But um, I swear something was meant to go in that. Or maybe... Was it like that before? Like, at some po other point in the episode? I don't know. But um, anyway, they are, both of them look quite cool. Um, they do look the same as quite a lot of the other Daleks. But still, um, it's accurate to the story. So that's fine. Um, and I'll probably get that. Um, and then here's the from the day, here's the one from Day of the God Daleks. Um, this is actually History of Daleks set seven because they didn't want to release um, two Daleks, um, two Dalek sets from the sixties, and they wanted to do some seventies Daleks. Um, this is of course um, Pertwee's sort of stuff, the third Doctor. Um, and these are oh, these are very 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 cool Daleks. These are very unique, and these are definitely the ones that I am going to um, I'm definitely going to get first if I see these like. I'll probably get both of these at the same time, just because Dalek sets um, get sold out really quickly. But this, if there was only two and I had to pick pick between one, then this would definitely be it. It looks really nice, and that is actually that is it actually it for um all the new B M sets. Which I thought there'd be more. I thought I thought there would be um I thought there'd be a Tardis really. Um, I know we just got one, but I thought we'd get a B M one. At least, in the, even if it wasn't a Tardis, I was hoping maybe for another three pack. We've we've only got two three packs, which is a bit odd. But um, I guess I'm sure they will release more stuff later in the year. It's just a bit weird. So this stuff is actually coming out um this month now. Um, so I better go. I'll be looking for them soon. Uh, and hopefully getting some. But um, anyway, guys, thank you for watching. Um, I'm excited for these, and I'll probably hopefully may review these. <laughs> I haven't done that many re um that many reviews very recently. So um, I don't know. I might do a review on that second dot that just came out. It just be it might be very negative. I really disappointed by that, except from the figure that it looked, it looked absolutely amazing. Um, but anyway guys, thank you for watching, and tell me what you think about these sets in the comments if you want, and I'll see you next time. Bye.